Hello, everyone, and welcome to CE Institute. My name is Selena Belial, and I am the founder of the school and one of the instructors. I usually teach certified paid CE certificate training and for CE credit for license renewal for massage therapists, body workers, and cosmetologists. However, we have many nurses and physical therapists and occupational therapists and acupuncturists and so forth at our school. Everyone is welcome. I am a certified holistic aromatherapist and I received my, it was a one year training that I did. I'm also a certified and licensed massage therapist, but my holistic aromatherapy certification was back in about 1996 from the New England um, School of Aromatherapy. It was a one year program where I went through a lot of training about the whole distillation process and reviewed several different essential oils in detail to learn more about their efficacy. And today I came across a study that was completed in August of 2018. We have a lot of questions here at the school, like would essential oils really improve? My massage therapy or bodywork services isn't doesn't this just smell nice or it might be a little bit relaxing or something and and I thought this study was a really nice um, show of effectiveness because they performed massage on a surgical nursing team okay in this study and they had some wonderful benefits with it they had about six massages and they used lavender essential oil which is one of the most popular essential oils used today and geranium essential oil which is less popular but i love uh, geranium essential oil i think it's great even in sports massage and athletic events for its healing properties. They used about a 1% concentration. So there was about 99% host oil with 1% essential oil in what was applied to these nurses during their massage. And they had six massages. And one of the things that they measured with the nurses was their heart rate and blood pressure. And in the results they published, there was a significantly um, statistical reduction in heart rate and blood pressure levels after the massage sessions. So for those of you who have stressed out clients and you want to provide a little bit more stress relief, maybe that you know that they're just really um, have maybe some anxiety or there was some issues, personal issues going on that's creating heavy burdens for your client and, and they're there for a massage because they just need to you know, unwind and, and get out of their body and get out of their world for an hour or whatever brought them to your office, just know that using essential oils can enhance the massage service, at, at the massage service, okay? You could use your essential oils in an ambient bowl or a diffuser, and you can also use the massage to directly apply topically to the skin during massage service. So there's many different ways you can use essential oil. Of course, if you apply it topically to their body and they don't shower after the service, they get to take that aromatherapy experience home with them. So again, my name is Selena Belial. I'm here at CE Institute. It's CE as in continuing education, ceinstitute.com. We do teach aromatherapy, body work, and massage services here at the school. And we'd love to see you in one of our classes. Until we do, be safe.